Hi guys, I'm Eric and welcome back to Canada Casino, your guide to online gambling. If you feel like you're getting bored of those cliche, most popular poker variations like Texas Hold'em, in this video, we're gonna give you one of the most exciting variations that'll surely rekindle that flame. The game we're talking about is open face Chinese poker. Let's get into the meat of the game right away. Each player receives 13 cards, which they then arrange into three different hands. Two five card poker hands and one three card poker hand. Top row, middle row, bottom row. Your hands have to increase in strength, starting with the three card hand at the top row. In other words, the top row has to be the weakest hand. Then the middle row has to be better than the top row. The bottom row with five cards, just like the middle row, has to also be better than the middle row. Straights and flushes don't count in your three card hand, only high card, pairs, and trips. If you organize your cards so that they don't follow these rules of strongest to weakest hand, you will foul and lose all three rows. And that, my friends, is called a dead hand. Getting a dead hand might not be as easy to avoid as you think because players don't get to see all of their hands at once. How the game is played. The dealer starts the game by dealing five cards to each player. Both players place the cards the best they can according to the ascending hand value rules. The dealer then deals three more cards each. Out of these three cards, each player discards one card and places the other two in their rows. This continues until all rows are full. Once everyone's hands are full, the point scoring begins. Each player compares their rows to the opponent's rows. Each row is worth plus one point. And if you win all three rows, it's called a scoop. If you do scoop it up, you will receive a total of six points. If you win two rows but lose one row, you receive plus one point. If you lose two rows but win one row, you receive minus one point. If you lose all three rows, you will receive minus six points. Ouch. What really sets open face Chinese poker apart from pretty much all other poker variants is its bonus round, which is also called royalties. The bonus point scoring table is pretty complex as you can see, so how does this bonus round work? Stay with me. In short, it depends what hand combinations you have in each row. For an example, let's do the bonus round to this player on my left. The bottom row has a flush, which gives them four points. The middle row is a straight, which gives them four more points. And the top row is a pair of aces, which gives them nine points. Adding this all together gives you a bonus of 17 points. Another little bonus round that is super fun and that you won't find in any other poker variation is called Fantasyland. You get to this Fantasyland level if your top row has a queen queen or better, without fouling of course. All in all, you have to have some pretty darn good rows to get to this point. But hey, it's nice to know that Candy, I mean Fantasyland, is there waiting. The gameplay in the Fantasyland round is a little bit different compared to the regular round we went through earlier. The player receives 14 of his or her cards at the beginning of the game, out of which the player can choose the best 13 and place them on the rows. Now remember, these cards are face down while your opponents are face up, a clear advantage to the player who's in Fantasyland. To stay in Fantasyland, you have to have quads or better in your bottom row or trips in your top row. Exactly, it's not that easy. When the player stops getting quads in every row, Fantasyland ends, and it's time to calculate those gazillions of points. That concludes our tutorial on open-faced Chinese poker. I hope you enjoyed learning about it and are tempted to give it a shot with friends or family, or even going straight to the casino. If you have any questions, make sure to leave them in the comments down below, leave a like if you enjoyed, and definitely subscribe for more videos like this coming soon. This was Canada Casino, and I'll see you guys next time.